Welcome to State Television Company, Western Armenian Broadcast for today. The 15th issue of the Western Armenian Weekly Magazine has been published. The 46th session of the Government of the Republic of Western Armenia, with the false establishment of peace by Turkey, Kiramian. Baku, with fake accounts, tried to positively present the decision to hold COP29 in Baku. Baku's fake on Ambert. Armenian martyrs of Western Armenia in 1915. Expressions to study the genocide against Armenians, tragic holes in history. Hi, Akve. New issue of Western Armenian Weekly Magazine has been published. Suluk Bridge of the Suluk Sluk village in Western Armenia, Bitlis Vilayat, Mesho Province, is on the cover of the new issue. On 27 May 1907, in Suluk, under the leadership of Gevurk Chaush, the Fidayins fought against the Turks. Gevurk Chaush died the next day, and in 1915, the village was destroyed. The inhabitants were massacred or displaced. In the newly published weekly magazine, you can read interesting and profound material, such as Armenia Cultural Union, the 14th anniversary, the event on the 14th anniversary of Armenia Cultural Union. Mount Nemrut, the Armenian Church, Amina Perkichev Shushi, and the desecration by Baku, Rafi Kortoshan. Dangers of the ecosystem of Western Armenia and other interesting articles. The Armenian, English, French, and Turkish versions of the weekly newspaper can be downloaded in PDF format below. On 29 October, the meeting of the Government Council of the Republic of Western Armenia was held. Ms. Lydia Margosyan, the President of the Republic, opened the session. She emphasized the important event held in bourg le valence in France. She mentioned the huge potential and significance of the Armenian community there. President Armenak Abrahamian spoke at the session and mentioned Artsakh. He compared the situation of Artsakh with Western Armenia. He presented the activities of the Fidayin and their key role in the liberation of Artsakh. Mr. President, you form this question will be addressed in more detail in the next sessions. Mr. Abrahamian also informed about the military medal created on his initiative and was included in the agenda of France. Mr. President emphasized that the medal expresses the importance of the heroic struggle of the Armenian people. With the false establishment of peace, Turkey will achieve the complete dismantling of the Armenian state. Turkologist Varujan Geramian wrote about this in his Telegram channel. The action started in 2020 in November when Armenians and especially the national elite agreed to do this, tolerating the fact of pro-Turkish rule for various reasons and pretexts. The last stage of this process is not the so-called peace treaty. The last stage will be us on the way to migration. The American newspaper The Washington Post claims the government of Baku tried to present the controversial decision to hold the COP29 in Baku in a positive light using fake users' account. The newspaper writes that the army of Azerbaijan was actively spreading the statement of Azerbaijani officials, including President Aliyev's assistant Hikmet Hajiyev, that Azerbaijan being an oil production country simultaneously promotes the production of Korean energy. At least 23 famous American politicians are still in prison in Baku. According to the analysis, the bots are spreading posts that have disparaged these prisoners using the hashtag criminals, not hostages. The Washington Post reports. Official Baku called these claims a dirty campaign against Azerbaijan. Especially on the eve of COP29, the Washington Post and some officials of the Congress are carrying out a dirty propaganda campaign against Azerbaijan, said Hikmet Hajiyev, assistant to the president of Azerbaijan. Ilham Aliyev instructed Azerbaijani scientists to study Western Azerbaijan, declaring that it is a historical Azerbaijan territory and the names of its cities and villages are of Azerbaijani origin. However, Ambert Castle, with its adjacent building, is not Azari or Turkic. It was founded in the 7th century by the Princess Kamsar, and in the 10th century it belonged to the Pahlavuni Prince and was an important military defense base on the Baghdad Union's kingdom. Ambert Castle's historical and cultural reserve includes the citadel, the walls, the Vahramashrein Catholic Church, and other buildings as well. The year 1915 is one of the most subtimal and tra tragic years in the history of the Armenian people. The genocide against the Armenians were carried out in the Ottoman Empire. During that time, the Armenians who had lived in Western Armenia for thousands of years were subjected to mass murders, deportations and other repressions. 
those terrible events left an indelible mark in the history of our people. The year 1915 was a terrifying but also heroic episode for Armenian mothers, which emphasizes their endurance, love, and patriotism. Armenian mothers have become a symbol of national identity and an example of heroism. Armenian mothers who faced these horrors lost their children, but their soul continued to fight. They preserved their cultural heritage, moral values, and global model of love and care. Removing the international recognition and condemnation of the genocide committed against the Armenians from the foreign policy priorities of Eastern Armenia is a dishonor to the memory of millions of genocide victims. Arad Mirzoyan's statement directly violates the collective will and message of the Armenian people regarding the recognition of the genocide. The phrase is tragical in history or research the genocide committed against the Armenians. We condemn the inefficiency of the genocide by presenting it within the framework of Turkish or Azerbaijani discourse. In 2023, the Hayak Fest civil initiative came out. It condemned the positions that belittle the significance of the genocide committed against the Armenians, for the implementation of which we are ready to hold accountable any violator. Dear viewers, this was all for today. I wish you good weekend. Goodbye.